I mean, I've always wanted to be a teacher. When I was a child, I remember that I used to teach my dolls. I used, used to line them uh, on, on the floor. And I got a present from my grandfather, a blackboard. I will never forget that. And by that time, it was the, the best uh, birthday gift I got. So I used to teach my dolls using that chalkboard. Oi, meu nome é Bené. Eu estou em Eugene, Oregon, há 10 anos e eu sou instrutora de português. Entenderam? Did you understand? Ok. I, my name is Bené, ok? And I've been here for 10 years. And uh, now I am a Portuguese instructor at, at the University of Oregon. I started as a Portuguese teacher, right? It was the first language I, I, I taught. Uh, at a high school in Brazil, but then I started, I started teaching English also. So I taught both languages, Portuguese and English, right? So after some time, I decided to, to do a kind of a master's degree. So then it was when I decided to come to Eugene because I liked the programs they had here. And uh, when I was about to complete my second master's degree here, I was invited to start the Portuguese program in the UFO. At the very beginning, it was a little weird for me because I used it to teach English in Brazil. So to teach, uh, for example, in Portuguese, to teach things like Oi, meu nome é Bené. Hi, my name is Bené. It was very strange for me at the very beginning, but then I got used to that. So the same way I used to teach English, it was the same way I teach Portuguese. We begin by teaching introductions and greetings, okay, but at the very beginning it was very weird. My experience has been great, fantastic. Uh, most of my students, they speak, speak Spanish fluently, which helps a lot, right? Although Portuguese is, a, is quite different, but uh, I feel very happy when I can see my students, especially the American students, when I see them communicating well in Portuguese. Some of my students study Portuguese because it has to do, I mean, some grad students, I always have grad students, some of them take Portuguese because they have to write something in their dissertation that has to do with the Portuguese language. For example, one of my students, she's from Africa, and she said she's going to write her dissertation in Portuguese. I have another student who's theme, the topic for his dissertation has to do with plants from the Amazon, something like that. Other students, the undergrad, some of them because they have a kind of family in Brazil, and some of them because they love the language, and they have plans to go to Brazil to study there. 